My name is Mark. I'm the general manager of Michael's Cigar Bar, located downtown in Worcester, One Exchange Place. We've been open for five years. I've been the general manager for about two. I've been here for the last three years before that as well. We specialize in premium whiskeys, premium beer, and also a, we have a full expansive large uh, walk-in humidor carrying thousands of cigars. We carry everything from Nicaragua to um, Nicaragua to down from Connecticut where they grow the wrappers. We are one of three in the city that is allowed to have smoking inside. It's a dying breed cigar bars. Um, we are the largest one. We do good business here. We do everything from fun nightlife towards uh, we have live music, dancing, to daytime where you can come in after work and hang out and low key, spread out, plenty of room in the lounge for everyone. So uh, we appeal to all ages and a lot of hours of operation down here. So we're always convenient, we're always open. Clientele is every, everyone from 21 to 85. Men, women, we also, uh, we have the cigars for the men. They tend to like those, the whiskey for the men. And then for the ladies, we do nice fruity cocktails. We have hookah water pipes. We have, uh, now a big thing in the cigar world is the flavored tobacco. We carry, uh, it's uh, the acid cigars, which women absolutely love. It's the blondies and like a Cuba Cuba. Real nice, light, sweet smoke. We offer over 50 varieties of scotch whiskey, about 15 varieties of bourbon. I offer rye whiskey. We offer uh, whiskey beer, beer that's actually fermented in whiskey barrels. Carry a large selection of stouts. So with the whiskeys you get in the Manhattans, you get into the old fashions. I'm Christian, I'm a bartender down here at Michael's Cigar Bar, and I'm gonna be making a Manhattan. Just taking a pour of the Maker's Mark for the bourbon. Just do a dash of the sweet vermouth. And a quick splash of bitters. Strain it into a glass with a cherry for a garnish. We have one of eight tobacconists in, the, in New England. His name's Tom Tortora. Uh, he knows everything top to bottom about cigars. My name is Tom. I work at uh, Michael's Cigar Bar. We're in the humidor here. We have cigar smokers that come in here anywhere from brand new, 21, uh, never had a cigar before, um, women, men, all the way up to uh, you know, 80, 90 years old who've been smoking their entire lives. Um, we carry um, all premium uh, tobacco, um, kind of the micro brews of cigars, um, they're called boutique brands. We have some bigger name brands that people are going to recognize, but we have a lot of new up and coming companies that we like to showcase and really get a lot more people involved, um, get people trying new things. A lot of times when we do events down here, um, we'll do pairings with uh, beer, wine, scotch, uh, whiskey, bourbons. Um, we do all kinds of stuff. Um, and surprisingly, cigars actually pair really well with a lot of the microbrew beer companies. I mean, we have some stuff in here that um, is really rare, hard to find. Um, I try to keep my pricing, especially on that stuff, really average so that people know they can come here and get that um, stuff that they're really looking for at, at a decent enough price. Um, we, we have some stuff in here where we're two people in the whole world that has it. I've been smoking for 10 plus years. Um, I was lucky enough to be trained by somebody who was in this industry for 35 years. Um, and I just, my, my passion was there. I really enjoyed smoking cigars. Um, I got lucky enough to get a position here um, and just built on that. Um, I, I got my certification as a tobacconist. Um, I'm one of eight in New England, so um, I, I have the knowledge base and I've worked hard for it. It's just a great time. I mean, it, it's funny because before I worked here, this is the place that I would come out to. So it's it's kind of fun to, to work at a place where you come out to. I mean, I see a lot of my friends here. I've made tons of new friends here. I mean, it, it's just a, a, a great time every time I'm working. It's not actually like work. It's, it's really just something I enjoy doing.